I never thought I'd be in Richmond to stay, seriously. Uh, academics were gypsies in those days. Uh, you'd do a few years here, a few years there, move around. Times have changed. But I thought maybe uh, U of R possibility. I'd known about it since I was a little kid. Uh, maybe Bucknell up in Pennsylvania, maybe American University in DC, something like that. Liberal Arts College was what I was looking for. But I came to Richmond, I got the opportunity to, to take the job, and they had confidence in, in me and, and showed it, and that was good. Got a big raise. Uh, figured I'd be here a couple of years. And before I blinked my eyes twice and turned around, 40 years had gone by. Uh, I got absorbed into the school, the students, uh, the, the growth and the change and the uh, progressive atmosphere that concealed itself very nicely at, at U of R. And then things happened along the way, totally unpredictably, the Robbins benefaction, uh, the bringing in of uh, new talent in the faculty, the change in the demographics of the student body uh, that changed it from a commuter school to a uh, regional powerhouse. Uh, all of those things had made it more and more interesting over the years as, as I worked along. Uh, finally, uh, simply the quality of the students I had to work with. Uh, they were incredibly talented and usually uh, incredibly motivated. Now, not always motivated in the directions you might like, but they were biddable and uh, they, they, could, they could focus their motivations better sometimes with a little help. But, uh, my children have been the same way. They mostly wanted to major in beer and girls. <laughs>